Hello guys, so today is Friday. May. I meant June. Lord. June 11th. Today is the right? So I'm actually currently in my kitchen right now. I'm sitting down right now. So I'm starting off this vlog letting you guys know that today I'm going to get my, my vaccine. So I signed up to get my vaccine um, about a week ago at um, Target by my house by CVS. And um, it was supposed to be for next week, which is next weekend. And they emailed me and was like, would you want to come in today? So I'm going to get the Moderna, 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 Moderna or something like that. If, if I'm saying it wrong, you know, whatever. I'm ready to get this vaccine, you know, only because I'd rather be safe than sorry. You know, I don't want to be out here, you know, not vaccinated. And if they have something, I was kind of skeptical about it first. But you know what? It's like, you know, with anything new that we try, we always skeptical about it. And, you know, I'd rather, you know, build up the antibodies towards it. And, you know, if COVID does come back strong like it did before, at least I know I did get vaccinated. I did took the right protocol or whatever. So I'm going to the Target that's by my house to get vaccinated at 5. It's actually like 3.50 right now. So I have a little time. I'm going to leave my house like 4.30 because I don't stay too far from the Target. So I'm just going to jump in an Uber. My bus is maybe like 15 minutes to 20 minutes of a ride because it stops at every stop on the bus. But if I take a cab, which is like $5, I'm going to just take a, um, a Uber. It's maybe like 5 to 10 minutes of a ride. Like it's not even that bad. So I'm going to... um getting an uber so this video is a little different because today was supposed to be my fashion diaries now i am gonna go pick out some pieces today i'm gonna go get vaccinated i was gonna do it earlier so that way when i do get vaccinated because i heard a lot of people say like when you get vaccinated you start feeling the symptoms and stuff so i didn't want to you know feel the symptoms and you know start shopping and all that stuff and i pass out or whatever so once I get vaccinated, um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna since I'm already in Target, I'm gonna take about another hour, and then I don't stay too far from Target. So like I said, if I start feeling like lightheaded or I start feeling like I gotta sit down, that type of stuff, you know, I just call myself a cab and I'll just go home or whatever like that. So I'm gonna search for some pieces in Target. So today's video, which is June 11th, will have to be posted tomorrow which is June the 12th or the 13th. Now, I do apologize. Like I said, some days I will delay the videos due to my schedule, but they caught me off guard with this vaccine. So I'm trying to get this done. This is my first dose. So my second dose is going to be on um, July 9th, I believe, because I think you got to wait like a month in between or like a, less than a month in between or something like that. So my second dose is July 9th. And they said supposedly the second dose is the, the one that hit you the most. So I heard everybody say they felt like little chills, lightheadedness, little knickknack paddywhack symptoms. Like if it's anything like when I've had my flu shot, I could deal with it because when I first got my flu shot, like the flu shot made me crazy sick. Like I felt like I was like with the flu, like I felt crazy. Sore throat, coughing, sneezing, body aches. Like I felt crazy. So if it's anything like that, then I guess I could handle it. But I, I wanted to ask them if I could take any supplements like Tylenol, Advil, Motrin, Ibuprofen, whatever you call it, just so I can, you know, re relieve that pain. So, um, I'm gonna wait in a few minutes and um, maybe I'll show you guys when I'm getting it done. It depends if I can record it because my phone battery is not that good right now. It's on like 40% because I was just going there and coming right back. Like I wasn't doing nothing crazy. But I wanted to make this intro real quick so you guys know what's going on. I'm going to put like a little um, description in the description box to let you guys know why I delayed the video today. I am still keeping up with my fashion diary. Don't think I'm not. But today I'm just going to get vaccinated. So, you know, that has to come first. That definitely has to come first because that's my health. That's with COVID. And I definitely feel like, you know, if you're out there, definitely consider getting the vaccine you know i'll let you guys know my side effects like how i feel when i come back home and i'll let you guys know like what's what so i'll see you guys um either today or tomorrow to finish off this video but this video will be incorporated with my fashion diary so i'll see you guys in a little bit be well be blessed stay true to yourself and i'll see you guys soon can see i'm in my house right now um today has been a crazy day today is friday may i keep saying may today is friday june the 11th and today was like really one of the worst days of my life but i tried to turn it into something positive 
you know, I always talk about relationships and, you know, right now I'm just kind of going through something, you know, relationship wise right now, man, you know, it's a little bit hard, but you know, it's not impossible to deal with, you know, I've dealt with things like that before. Um, just had a really, really low day today. Um, I'm vaccinated. I'm not sure that you guys can tell by the band-aid, but I'm vaccinated. I got my first dose of the Moderna. Sorry for the handwriting because whoever this guy was who was doing my, my shot, he just like, is just like, he has no handwriting, no good handwriting whatsoever. So basically right now, it's like 10 o'clock going on 11 right now. Right now I'm starting to feel the effects earlier. I started to feel a little dizzy like an hour after I did it. My arm started to hurt and right now my arm is starting to hurt more. And right now I got this headache. So I don't know if that's some of the effects that come with it. But I finally got my first dose. Definitely. I'm excited about that. I got my first dose. My COVID call. Once I get the second one in July, it fell. Once I get the second one in July, I'll show you guys um, pretty much. Um, I'll laminate it so that way it's done. It's stating I got both doses and I'm good. So um, today I went. I, so what happened was I went to Target earlier to get my vaccination. As I said, today was a long day. Me and my partner, we just got into a huge fight today. So right now I'm just trying to, you know, take it easy. You know, right now I just need to focus on what really makes me happy right now and what I need to be happy right now. And, you know, nothing, you know, crazy. Like I said, in relationships, you're going to go through things. If you don't, you wouldn't be in a relationship if you didn't. You know what I'm saying? So I came back in the house because I was feeling so weak, like so drenched from the, the vaccine. But right now I'm starting to feel it the most. Like after I record this video, I'm about to lay down. So um, I don't have like a sore throat or anything. I just feel kind of like tired and more like a little slight headache. Like the headache is not unbearable. So don't think it's anything like that. Do you guys like my little background? It's just so fucking pretty. Like I love it. The lights, I put new batteries in these lights. They look good on screen right now, but in reality, they never really like that. Like in person, they look crazy, but right now it's crazy, I don't know. But I went to Burlington, as you can see the brown bag right here. So this fashion diary is gonna be a little bit different right now. I'm gonna show you guys some things that I picked up and I'm not sure if I'm gonna style it or whatever, because like I said, the fashion diaries is gonna be incorporated with me picking up things, also along with me trying on things. But I want you guys to see the little pieces and you know outfits and stuff that I get from different stores. So this particular store was Burlington, right? So the first item that I bought, I just came back. It's like 10.30 at night. They closed at 11, so that's why I went back. I had a Michael Kors shirt about four, maybe, no, like two years ago. I don't know where that shirt went. I don't know if God took it away and stashed it somewhere where I can't find it, but anyway. I found this pretty pink MK shirt, this Michael Kors shirt, right? So we're gonna do some prices right now. The detailing on this is really nice. I'm like detailing, ain't got no fucking detailing. This is the only detailing that it has. Um, price wise, this shirt in reality was $78. Can you see? I got a size 3X, that's my, my size. On sale today, I paid $24.99, which I thought was a, a bargain. From, what I said? From 70 something dollars. And as you see, it got the Michael Kors tag on it. So that I thought this was pretty for the summer, something light, it's cute. You know, it's a nice little tee, you know? I'm not sure if I'm gonna style this for you guys. It's really stretchy, just so you guys know. So that's one thing, right? Also, I picked up these leggings. You guys know I love leggings. So, like I said, black is my favorite color. I always gotta have something black. So I picked up these leggings, size 3X, from BB. The brand is called BB. I'm not sure if you guys ever heard of BB. I, this picture that I got right here is from BB. The Hustle Harder, I'm not sure if you can see, Hustle Harder, that's from BB, that picture right there. So I never really bought their clothes. Um, the price for this was $16.99. I paid $16 for these. So I thought these was cute. And also, this is a size 3X, size three from BB. So I'm gonna be rocking those real soon. The material of this kind of feel like sweats, but leggings, if you get what I'm saying. But these are kind of be like my get up and go. These are kind of be for work, only because in my work office, they blast the AC. So the AC stay on blast. So when I'm in work, they give us these blankets right here. They give us these blankets. This is my job logo hard to haul home care so I'm in the office and when I'm usually in the office I kind of like wrap up like this because the air 
it, it, let me say something. In the summer, it's different when you have a, 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 say I'm just sitting like this all day, right? And it'd be different if you just sit in there and the air is constantly blowing on you, so you'd be freezing in there, you know what I'm saying? So these type of leggings will kind of work good for, because the material is kind of like silk, but they not, they kind of like stretch band material. But these was cute. They have BB going down both sides of the pants. I thought that was cute. And then, the last shirt, like I said, you guys know I love black. I picked up this pretty shirt with the, I think these are horoscopes. Horoscopes? Uh, I don't know what the fuck this is, but it's nice. Comment down below if you know what the symbol and stuff is. I don't know, it's just a regular black t-shirt. Regular black t-shirt. Um, it was by the brand Pop Kiss. Pop Kiss, not sure if you ever heard of that. Um, they had it. Uh -uh. <coughs> no, something just in my throat. No. Okay, disregard that. Because I'm like, hold on. I got the vaccine. I keep forgetting. Um, the price was $8.99 for these. For this shirt. $8.99. So nice little black tee. Something to throw on. Size was 2X or 3X, I believe. What size did I get? 3XL. Everything I get is 3XL. Sometimes 2XL, like I said, depending on the stretch. So this is something that I, I, I used to write and you know, I, I want to get back into writing. Let me actually pull out a book right now so I can show you guys. This is one of my books that I used to write poetry in. I bought this book at Walmart maybe like two years ago. You can see it's kind of like ripping up and everything. I'm going to show you some things I used to write. I'm not sure if you guys can see. I used to take and I used to write, like highlight stuff. I just write, like writing is my thing. It's really, it's really therapeutic. You should try it. If you're ever going through something, like right now, I just wanna sit down, light a candle and write. That's one of the best vibes you can do for yourself because it's like you're, you're, you're getting all the toxins out of your body. And I feel like after a long day that I had today, writing is what I need to do. So I picked up this new book. I, you know, I'm like a kid. I should have picked up some pens. They had pens in there. I'm a pen fanatic. Like, I love ballpoint pens, the little gel pens. But this says, do what you love and do it often. Design a life you love. Now, if you guys look at this photo right here, this photo says she designed a life she loved. I'm going to try to zoom in so you guys can see. It says she designed the life she loved. And, you know, I thought this was kind of similar. It actually has the same handwriting as that picture. So I'm not sure if this is a... This book was only $4. And look how thick it is. So, you know, one of my favorite things to do is to go to the beach or even the pier. Somewhere where it's water. I'm going to tell you something. When you're ever going through something, the most important thing you can do is get in nature. Nature is God's given way of healing. Trust me, it is. Like, for me to sit by the water, you know, I got a little drink by my side. I'm hydrated. I'm sitting there. I'm just letting my thoughts out on paper. You know, I actually, you know how many people used to tell me when I was in school to write a book? Because I used to write so much. And my whole, I just write about my experiences, things that I've been through, things like that. And I think that's really something that I want to look into, writing my own memoir, my own book. So this is something I thought the cover was phenomenal. It says, do what, I'm sorry it's not transparent. Do what you love and do it often. Design a life you love. And that's what I'm doing now with YouTube. I'm designing a life that I really love for YouTube. So this was something really pretty that I really will cherish this book. And for $4, you cannot beat it. So another thing that I bought, hold on. You guys pretty much know all my products are Apple now, right? So I have AirPods now. This case is all beat up. I'm not sure if you can see. It's not transparent on screen, but this case is all scratched up. It's crazy. I always wanted to get AirPod cases, but every time I go to find some, they never had the ones that I want, and they got cheap looking ones. So I was in Burlington, right? And I was like, oh, hold up. Ooh. I usually go to Target to get most of my stuff, but Target always have like the, the um, Heyday ones. I'm not sure if you've ever been to Target and you have AirPods and you've seen like Heyday, the brand Heyday, like my charging pad that I showed you guys. Um, so this brand is called Love Ellie. Love Ellie? love Ellie and this is a cute AirPods case this was cute and it was $4.99 right so I bought this one it kind of got this little um little ocean type of gold thing going on right here let me see if I can angle a little bit this way oh okay it's not letting me let me change the setting of the light 
Let me try to load. Okay, Love Ellie. It kind of shows better like that. I kind of lowered the thing. So Love Ellie, and it actually says Love Ellie on the case itself, right? So I bought that one and I bought, oops, I bought this one that looks just like this one. They're the same one, just different, um, different colors, really. Well, no, because they don't. This one don't have the gold right here, but the same concept. You get what I'm saying. So I bought those two, and I also I fell in love with this one. It's like the transparent stars. Oh my, the unicorn looking one, and it's all clear to go in my thing. Woo! So you guys know, I'm gonna have fun. I'm gonna have fun. Um, I'm, oh my God, wow! I, you know this ring light is bugging out lately i need to really get i'm sorry if the lighting is off right now but it doesn't even matter because i'm about to end this video um the i want to get a new ring light if you have some some recommendations of a good ring light link it down below because i really need to invest in a really good one and i'm talking about like high beam one too so yeah this transparent unicorn one was so pretty i just want to be able to switch up with my airpods cases because i never had any for my airpods so I thought this was cute just to throw it on your case to look stylish even if this is messed up once you put the case on you won't really tell you know what i'm saying so um backstory on the airpods today because i was in target and i actually lost one in target and i'm in a fitting room trying to try on some dresses now if you know ava and viv ava and viv and the target by my house been slacking i'm sorry they haven't really had no um freaking good looking clothes lately now i'm not saying that about even even viv is bomb this shirt i got on is even viv even viv baby that's all i wear even viv is a good plus size collection trust me but i just feel like that like for instance this blue shirt right here even viv those my two i'm like those my two favorite stores those these are my my brands even viv i love them I have a jean jacket over there from Ava and Viv. Like, it's crazy. But long story short, I want to, um, this selection been, been real corny. Like, so I want to try to look in different targets to see what I can find. And that's the end of this video. I know it's all over the place. I'm not sure, like I said, if I'm going to style some of these pieces on that I showed you guys. I just wanted to show you guys. Like I said, it's still a part of the fashion diaries because it's basically showing you guys the trendy new looks that I have and that I'm going to be wearing. So... I am going to try to post more pictures, more on Instagram, so definitely follow my Instagram. I'm going to try to link my Instagram right here so you guys can follow me. Don't forget to follow me to keep up with me. I post pretty much every other day on it or every day, so definitely keep up with me. And that was the haul. That was the Burlington um, haul. That was a part of my fashion diaries, and I hope you guys enjoy. Like I said, stay tuned. Some videos will be try-ons, and some videos won't be try-ons. Some videos will just be hauls of what I got. And then I'll try it on later. So, you know, definitely bear with me. It's still new to me. So I love you guys. Be well, be blessed. Stay true to yourself. Never let anybody tell you you cannot do something in life. If you have a dream, you go for it. Remember, remember to always keep your peace no matter what you are going through in life. Always try to keep your peace. Um, you know, today I let my anger get the best of me. I'm not going to lie. Like, but I was super frustrated with the situation. And, you know, it takes a lot to get me angry. And anybody who knows me, like, I don't get angry over any little thing. So you had to really do something to really make me angry. So, you know, right now I'm just trying to calm myself down. I'm starting to feel a little woozy a little bit from the, the vaccine. But I'm about to lay down, wash my face and stuff off, wash my arms and stuff off, and get in my bed. So that's the end of this video. Like I said, guys, be well, be blessed. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.